This is the UV K5-8 and this is the original K5. Not only that, I've also got the UV5R+. Plus. Now, all of these radios are pretty much all the same internals. They can be modified for uh, firmware modified for expanded frequency coverage. There's other modifications to fix the AM in these because they do work out of the box, but in any strong signal environment, then they get overloaded. So uh, there was a fix for that and it receives AM quite well. So you can listen to airband radio. There was also spectrum analyzer mods and all sorts of different things. And if you want to check out some of those, then there will be some videos at the end of this video that you can use to um, have a bit of a play about. But one of the things that did interest me was uh, SSB on this radio. Now, I was come across a post uh, on social media that there's been, there's firmwares everywhere for this thing um, that are coming out. And one of them was the ability to receive and also to transmit on SSB. It's kind of SSB, kind of not. It's labeled in the uh, radio as double sideband and it doesn't sound all that good but we're going to try it anyway and see how it goes so basically what it is is the ijv mod loading this mod is quite straightforward all you need is a browser you can just open up the link which will be in the description below and a programming cable such as this this is a baofeng programming cable with the two pin connector you can get these from radio oddity if you don't have one some viewers have had some issues with some programming cables and i put that down to probably the chip that is in here um, it might not be the correct one that you need but if you uh, get one of these programming cables that looks like this this is all that i've used you might need to um, install drivers uh, have a look on the radio oddity website the baofeng website uh, and get those drivers if you have any problems basically all you do is you press the ptt button on here on the side push that in turn the power knob here and you'll see that the light on the top will come on then what you do is you flick open the little flap here on the side, which is for the programming cable ports. And then you insert the cable and you'll see there will be a little blue light like that on the radio. And now all you have to do is press program or flash on the browser. You will be prompted for permission to use your COM port. It will have a list of COM ports. Select the one that is the cable that's been, alloc that's been allocated to the programming cable and the radio will start flashing the firmware. So now that we've done that, I've got my radio, my IC9700 here on 144, 150. Turn on the radio. You can see that it is in the SSB or double sideband mode already and I'll show you how to get into that. Basically, go to the menu and scroll down, find the mode, hit menu again, you can select AM, you can select FM, which it probably will be by default, or DSB. Go to bandwidth and this will be probably on wide, select narrow, uh, there we go, narrow, I'm not sure what narrow minus is but select narrow. Menu item number 54, you might wanna set your AGC. You've got slow, fast, or manual. I'm just gonna leave mine on fast. You can adjust the steps as well. You can go all the way down to 0 0.2 kilohertz. So then we can adjust it in very small steps. Okay, 7HH testing, one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Not sure how that sounds. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, seven HH testing. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Testing one, two, three, four, five. Then one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, seven HH testing on one forty four one five zero. Testing one, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two. So yeah, I mean, it kind of works. Let me know how you go in the comments below if you've managed to get it receiving or transmitting a little bit better. It's obviously all experimental. We're not trying to get perfection or we're not trying to get, uh, you know, we don't expect this thing to do tr like true SSB. There's a pile of other modifications that you can do to this radio. If you want to watch what those are, then there is a link that has appeared right here on the screen. So check those videos out right now.